So Parkinson's is a slowly progressive neurologic disorder that's a problem in motor control. So people don't have weakness, but they have problems controlling movement. So they may have slowness of movement, difficulty getting up from a chair, problems with balance, and sometimes, but not always, some tremor at rest. We think that it's a combination of both hereditary factors and environmental factors that lead people to develop Parkinson's. That um, sometimes the hereditary factors are very, very strong, but that's a minority of cases. We do not believe that Parkinson's is more common in people of Ashkenazi background, but there are studies going on so that we can understand this better. Um, it's of course a big question because there are two genes which increase the risk of Parkinson's which are more common in people of Ashkenazi background. So the question is if we have these genes, why isn't there more Parkinson's um, in the Ashkenazim? Most people with one of the two Parkinson's genes, either LARF2 or GBA, will never develop symptoms. So it's important that even though a lot of people carry these mutations, most of them will never develop Parkinson's. We are very hopeful in understanding the genetics, we will come to better treatments. And ultimately that there will be specific therapy related to the underlying cause of Parkinson's. For more information about this topic, including a webinar and supplemental written material and resources, please visit MyJewishGeneticHealth.com.